Alrighty then. Good morning, everybody. It's me, your friendly local community manager, Emily. How's it going? <laughs> um, so it's a it's a strange morning here in New Zealand for all of us. Um, we're in lockdown again, which is cool. Um, so to the stream will probably be a little bit more low energy just because you know lockdown be locked down um do not worry though new zealand's pretty still pretty good on the covid front we've only got only got like five active cases i think at the morning good timing jacinda just finished her facebook live oh nice cool yeah she's good she's good um so yes, since the lockdown is a little bit of a shock, it's come very suddenly, um, I'll, I'll probably be a little bit more quiet today. I hope that's all right. Um, but that doesn't mean that I'm not happy to be here chatting on the internet with y'all. Just have to fix my chair and then we'll be good. Still waiting for that Secret Lab sponsorship. Secret Lab, if you're watching this, give me a sweet spot, oh please. Okay, so today, Sam will be joining me, as per usual, at about 11 o'clock, or in an hour's time, if you're not in this time zone. Um, and I'll just be vibing and playing before we leave. I'm trying to get Astra Bellini in mind still. Um, so let's see if we can do that. <laughs> and very aptly, the planet that we're gonna be doing it on is called get vaccinated <laughs> that's pretty funny if you ask me all right so where was i last week i researched some very important stuff i believe that's all done now cool i've got protective clothing got the shielding Marvellous. How is everyone today? Inside and outside of New Zealand. <sighs> and, and good morning, Anna. Good morning, Sam. I might just bring my mic a little bit closer just because I am being a bit more quiet today. So let's just make sure you all can hear me. Okay, there we go. Let's just... Ta-da! Right, let's build an astrobolini in mine. Okay, so I need to make good clothing. Ah, hello, a wild Harley. Hello, hello. I am very good. Um, I don't know if you just heard my little spiel. Uh, if you didn't, we're in lockdown again. So I'm just like a bit shocked. Uh, but other than that, I'm great. Oh, have my coffee. I accidentally put the wrong milk in my coffee today. Didn't notice until I was like about to take a sip and I was like, that's the wrong carton. Oh my gosh. So that's where I'm at today. <laughs> oh. I think my chair's a little bit too far forward. Let's just, oh, let's just fix that too. There we go. There we go. There's nothing worse than having a chair that like pushes you forward a little bit. It's so uncomfortable. Um, okay. A wheat fit. No, I don't want wheat. I want cotton. Oh, rosy cotton with flowers in her hair. Um, can I put cotton down? Nope. Uh, cool. I'm going to have to import my clothes. That's A-OK. -okay. That is a okay. Um, my mum just fed the chooks outside the ranch slider door that I'm sitting next to. So there are four different coloured chickens and about a dozen parrots, dozen sparrows. Wow, pecking around the grass just over there. Oh, that sounds lovely. That sounds rather picture worthy. <laughs> I wonder if I could 
be really oh no that's really not I'm trying to figure out how I can get clothing production on this very planet I think it would just suck tbh t b h can I do it here wouldn't that be funny no I can't do anything on the swamp island <laughs> let's just get that back baby come back oh hello I forgot about this island what about you nope this is a very tricky little island that's right I abandoned this place that's right I just straight up abandoned it um, let's go to ball gear okay no 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 how many that's right I've just discovered this one I think hmm I think I'll just do it at my main planet, which is Toffee Pop. It needs a name. Uh, which one? Which one? Buddy, I'm done. Oh, I've still got research to do. That's a bit cool. Um, I really should research everything, huh? That abandoned island three. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe if I unabandon it. All right. What's my clothing production here like? Uh, I don't want that. I want that. So it looks like there is some clothing stuff happening here. Oh, Taylor. Here we go. Look at that. Marvelous. Distributing it to all the houses and to outer space as well. Okay, let's just uh, see what is happening. So, Toffee Pop to get vaccinated. There's already clothes going there. That's cool. Um, I might just... Sometimes I like to just redo all of my shipping lanes because I forget that they're going so I'll uh, I'll just like keep sending that particular place resources when I don't actually need to so it's good to just stop every now and then in my humble opinion okay so we've got a regular old weaver now it's time to build the upgraded ones um do i upgrade these ones or do i just hmm yeah let's do that let's do that i need more of the fabric and i okay yeah i see i see i see okay let's get some uh sheepies no sheepies here hello bowie how are you how's it going Um, sheep, please, sheepums, maybe they'll like the desert, nope, no, okay, maybe I'm not going to do my fancy clothing here, because I'll do it on this planet, Squoggle, yes, good, very good. Mm. <laughs> I'm glad you're good. Marvelous. Um, I think all the crew here at Bouncy Monkey Games are good. We've, I think, don't know if you were around for the start of the stream, but um, we've just gone back into lockdown here in New Zealand. Um, as of like less than 24 hours ago um, so I'm feeling a little bit more quiet today 
but that might change. But, but you know, we're safe. We're happy. Yeah. Very, not been around for long at all. Just 13 minutes. <laughs> it's all good. Um, oh, we've got heaps of wool here. That's marvellous. Okay, 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 okay. So where is my clothing being made here? Is it being made here? I have my coffee, everything's okay. <laughs> and I have so many coffee beans, thanks to my flatmates who went down to a lovely little town called Raglan on the North Island of New Zealand. And they have like a coffee roasting place there. And their coffee beans are so good. So they got me a massive bag. So I'm good. Don't have to worry about that. My friend Kuja. How are you today, Kuja, by the way? Oh. Decaf at 6 p.m. Very wise. Very wise. <laughs> Two of my flatmates drink coffee at night. One of them being my partner. He's like, yeah, I'll just have like a Red Bull at 8 p.m. And then go to bed. At like one, no worries. I'm like, oh my god, you you cannot be contained. You're too powerful. With great power comes great responsibility. So I'm not making clothes here at all, probably because I can't grow cotton. So let's export the wool off this island and not grow it there. Oh jeez, look at all that pollution. Let's just build something to fix that. <laughs> There's already one there. Oh no, that's not a pollution thing. What am I looking at? A toolsmith, got it. You know what, let's just build two for posterity. <laughs> oh no! Your internet went out. Oh. How was that experience for you, Kuja? Was it like, you know, the typical call center experience when your internet's broken and they get you to do like lots of troubleshooting and you're like, please, I've done all of that. I just need you to log the fault. <gasps> Man, you don't even drink coffee. Wow. Well, that's probably good. Um, this is a cute little island. I quite like it. Um, okay, excellent. We've got cotton. So if I import... The wool here If I import the wool here we should be in good form. Okay, so we want to go from Bridgerton to Struth. Oh, I'm already doing it. That's great. Don't need steel anymore by the looks of it. Bridgerton to Boring Isle, huh? Um, let's just ditch that. Um, right. Oh, hey, Wabby! How are you? Um, oh, that's nice of them to do it for you, Kuja. Um, <clears throat> I know this is the kind of question you ans you've answered hundreds of times, but how many people worked on this game? Um, don't mind answering that at all. We don't get that question too often, I find. Um, but it was, at the time it first shipped on the Epic Game Store last year, it was me, community manager, Isaac, tech artist programmer, Sam, obviously. Um, we had 
James, our audio engineer. We had Benedict, our composer. We had... Um, oh my gosh. Rafael doing 3D art. We had Ed doing UI. We had um, Sam. Help. 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 <laughs> I do not code. I do not code. No. Um, I can do a little bit of programming, but it's like, oh, it's like running uphill for me. A very, very steep hill. It's so hard because I don't do it very often. I feel like programming is one of those things where you just have to keep beating your head against the wall over and over again. Um, I feel like there was more people. So yeah, as Kuja said, four official employees now. So me, Isaac, Sam and Anna, <coughs> and a bunch of contractors. Oh my God, I forgot Saf, our writer. Um, how could I forget Saf? Because she's like a friend. <laughs> Sorry, Saf. Um, also devs playing their game on live stream is awesome. Yeah, it's pretty cool, right? playthrough before we leave. This will be my like second full playthrough I think. Um, Wabby, you asked something. <laughs> um, I'm well, yeah. We've just gone into lockdown again here in New Zealand so I'm a little bit more subdued than I usually would be but other than that I am I'm great. I'm just happy to be safe actually. It's pretty cool. Yep, let's upgrade that. And let's Get a regular tailor here as well. Uh, yep. Wait. <gasps> Frick! I've already got one upgraded. Dang it. That's okay. I'll just make another one. <laughs> I didn't even know I had a good weaver and a good tailor already. Oh. That's why I was importing wool. I didn't even question it. I was like, oh, that's interesting. Anyway. Um. Yes, we do have scorpions. Where did the scorpion go? We've got a little bit of coral as well. Coral! That kills people. Coral! Um. Get over here! <laughs> yes, we are all staying safe. We've got... I'm fully vaccinated, I think. Oh, here's the scorpion. Oh, his name's Wobbly! Wobbly the scorpion. Cute. Um, yeah, and I think that... Isaac's had his first shot with the Pfizer. Um... And we're masking up and staying home. Um, yeah, man. Wow, this planet is going to be flush for clothes. So I don't actually want the peeps using any of the good clothing. Um, I want to ship all of it so oh gosh we got another space well coming actually let me think 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 Would it make more sense to make the cl protective clothing here rather than shipping it? Where is it? Oh, I'm doing a big thing, folks. If I can find it, where is it? Protective clothing. One thing that I want to do in our next game is like have a better layout of these bars because they really confuse me 
as you all can probably tell if you've been watching the stream for a while, it's not unusual for me to do this. Um. Oh my god, where is the protective clothing? I've researched it. Hmm. Oh, beg your pardon. You're right, Sam. I did forget about that. I always think you have to make them and then... Yeah. It's more. It's more. Much more streamlined. So I do have to ship the, the clothing there. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. No doubt, no doubt. This game is so cute. Oh, thanks. Yeah, it is cute, huh? I need a cuddle. Thanks. Oh, yeah, we give a big... A big heck. A heck and heck. <laughs> um, that's why we listen to feedback all the time. Like, recently-ish, in like the last month or two maybe, we sat down and like went through so much feedback, like Reddit, Steam forums, Steam reviews... Um, our social platforms, Discord, and just, like, logged so much feedback. Um, and, wow, just, like, poured through it all and was like, okay, what can we actually do to make the game better for people? Um, and we're doing that sort of thing pretty frequently because we care, you know, you, you guys keep our lights on, like I, like I usually say. All right. Oh, that we've had a, a gremlin come good. Oh, the story game. The story game. Y'all need to read this. It's so good. It's so good. It's so good. Um, maybe one day I'll like sit down on stream and like read that out. Get my reading voice on. Um. <laughs> a contingency arrival says big brain. That's me. And goldfish show. Oh, hi! Says a heckin' chonky think. That's me. Doing a big heckin' chonky think. 24 sev on the reg. <laughs> Alright, where should I put. Let's go in from that angle. Gotta get this right. Uh, where'd the elevator go? There it is. And we got to get good clothing here. We got to ship it. Oh, that's the island that is abandoned. Sad Isle. <laughs> Let's just call it Sad Isle. There we go. <clears throat> so I know to avoid it. Um, we want education sending those are good clothes. Edumacation. So, such a silly name. Sam, did you name that? I feel like that's a Sam name right there. Uh, let's kill that. Yes, I might want to do that. Thank you. Alright, mint. And now we got to go to outer space, folks. we got to Jeff Bezos this. And oh. um, squoggle to get vaccinated. Get those clothes over there ASAP. Then <laughs> we're doing a logistics. Okay, we want Bridgerton to. Boring Isle with no. We want Struth to Boring Isle. I feel like I'm doing maths. <laughs> if Timmy has ten good clothes and Jenny has seven, what time of day does the sun rise? 
Oh, you get out of it. Get out of Toffee Pop, you big stinky space whale. Get out of it. Oh, that's good fabric. Frick, I don't want that. No, 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 none of that, none of that, none of that. There we go. That's what I want. And let's just... Oh. Let's not do that right now. Okay, now I can check chat. Now that I've, like, done that extremely hard maths. <laughs> Kuja with those bars are perfectly logical. <sighs> Maybe not for my little brain. Um... Discord trolls, what? And user experience sounds like the hardest thing to optimize even for big studios so I can understand how indie struggle. Yes, and it's different for every single person. Like this system here will make sense to someone. So like, yeah, depending on what your experience is with games and like just what, what makes sense to you, you know, you'll have a very different experience. Oh, is he upside down, this space whale? Okay, let's hope he's just a little boy. He's a baby boy. And he's coming to eat my planet. I want to see my little boy. Uh, please be small. Okay, sweet. <sighs> just like antagonizing the space while being like, Oh, you're a baby boy. You little baby. You're a baby. <laughs> baby, baby, baby. <laughs> I don't think space wells would like that very much, come to think of it. Is there another dev in chat? So there's... <laughs> so there's... I think everyone's here. I think the whole crew's there, actually. The sun rises at dawn, obviously. Easy math. A oh, <laughs> You s I sent the good clothes to the wrong island? Yeah, you're probably right. You thought Kuja was a dev. Uh, no, Kuja's just our friendly local uh, friend and boy. Giver of feedback. And yes, my name is indeed Emily. The one and only. I get really excited when I meet other Emilies in game development. There aren't many of us. There can only be one. Friendly is a lie. Is it? Is it? Um, <laughs> Isaac, I'm not here. <laughs> I hope I haven't missed anybody's c -c -c comments. Sorry if I have. Oh, Anna with the. Is that a limerick? It always sounds like a limerick or something from the Muppets. Um, okay, so let's see if the boss man was right. Have I sent something to the wrong island? Probably. Highly likely. Ah, oh, Sam, you're right as per usual. <laughs> I'm impressed you noticed that, actually. You must be paying close attention to my stream. Thank you. I feel very valued. So we want to go from Struth to Boring Isle. Thank you. Saving my bacon as per usual. And we want to go from Bridgerton to Struth. Um, great names. All right. Ah. A Spike Milligan poem. Oh, wow. Is he Aussie or Kiwi? I feel like I've just... Spike Milligan. Oh, he's Irish. <laughs> is Spike Milligan Australian? I, I thought he was Australian. Okay, he's most certainly Irish. My bad. <laughs> I'm like, just pinching everybody. Hello, Yuri Machos. Who's... Who's Backseat Gaming? What? 
Sam. Oh, no. No, no, no. That's allowed. That's fine. That's fine. If I do something like that, I want to know. Um. Typing on a phone is very hard. Especially on Twitch. The Twitch phone client isn't fantastic, I will say. Um, okay, okay, folks. How are we doing? Ooh, I'm running out of food here. Can I irrigate these, maybe? Oh, we can ir Are you ready to irrigate? Oh, this is a bit hot. Let's just... Let's irrigate these suckers. Get them creating food a little bit faster. Don't know where the water's gonna come from. <clears throat> Um, oh, you know what the great thing about lockdown is, folks? Can you hear that? Exactly. There's no traffic outside. It is so quiet. So you won't hear any sirens this stream. You won't hear any Harley Davidson motorbikes. You won't hear any trucks. You won't hear any Mustangs with really, really rich men going past. It's so can't wait to have some good sleeps. <laughs> uh, it's like screen tests or whatever the name of those things are in the movie industry. Oh, I didn't even know those were a thing. Uh, studio changing the end of their movies because of diff people's reaction to the screen. Oh, wow. It's a whole different story. UX is important, but your vision is equally important. True that. True that. Are you also in Germany, Bowie? Are you one of our German crew? <laughs> Look at that! Irrigation! Um, yeah, your English is really good, Bowie. I get back from putting taco ingredients on the stove to you saying the peeps are running out of food. Go give us your tacos! Could not un oh. Could not unload the shit. Okay, this is an important thing to fix. So my port's full. All right. All right. All right. All right. Look at all the warehouses I have on this island. Holy smokes. <laughs> oh, I can actually just upgrade the ones that I have. Marvelous. <coughs> Pardon me. Sorry, folks. I'm a little bit phlegmy today. Um, so I've got cement. Okay, I feel like I could probably put the cement in here. Let's just do the 20 cement. Cement. Such a nice little addition. So before we leave, didn't ship with this little thing here. I don't know what you'd call it, but I was so excited when it got put in. It's like so good. <laughs> it's just like one of those really nice little improvements. Um, when I say before we leave, didn't ship with it. I mean it didn't ship with it on EGS specifically. Oh, you're from Quebec. Nice. Uh, bonjour. <laughs> My French is terrible. I'm not going to offend you with it. Um. Um. <laughs> um. Sorry, I was catching up on chat. I know I love the little slider too. Isn't it great? So good. So damn good. I should um upgrade my um 
my elevators at some point, huh? Probably no point on this island because it's pretty quiet, but... Um, okay, how else can I free up this port? We got electronics too. Electronics. Alright. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I know, I know. Um, let's make that... Tw was it 20 as well? Or is it if memory serves, sweet. Okay, that should be fine now. Before we leave ship, shipped with every, oh, with every, with even, what? Have you, do you remember that piece of feedback, Kuja? How long have you been in our Discord now? It's ages, I know that. It's got to be a year, right? Right. Okay. So that should be sorted. Mischief managed. Maybe. Min mischief. Mischief managed. Maybe. It was August of last year, so around a year. My God, that's gone fast. I feel like such a grandma every time. I'm like, wow, time moves so fast, but it's true. <laughs> Time moves so fast these days, I don't understand how or why, just that it simply does. You know what? Let's um, upgrade the roads here. What do I need? I need a road layer, huh? Okay, let's do it. I'm like using this planet a lot, so. Oh, I need thulium, huh? I love how you can like put the road layer on the highlands and it just like kind of clips through the world onto the bottom so good makes me laugh um i don't like that position so let's uh let's slap a road here and do that just a, a little road layer on the beach will we see another pentagon 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 where are you It's a bit glary where I'm sitting right now, so I'm having trouble seeing the dark screen, but... Where are you, little pentagon? Now I'll be around somewhere. <laughs> Lazy community manager. Um, we've got... Okay, we need electronics. We need fuel, and we need tools. I could have sworn we were shipping tools here already. Um, the old webcam's blocking everything again. Okay, sweet. I am sending tools here, I thought so. Okay, that doesn't need to be a thing anymore. Gosh, I'm sending a lot of stuff here. Let's actually, um... I most certainly don't want to delete that shipping lane. Let's not do that. Let's add an extra ship to it, though, just to help things out. In the lake south of where you are now. Ah, oh, oh. Like here? Down. Ah, oh, bingo. Yep. Here it is. We found it. Thank you, Harley. We got there eventually. <clears throat> and the pentagons are indeed there to keep the planets spherical because you can't pave a sphere with hexagons entirely something that I didn't know until I started working on before we leave <laughs> so funny the things you learn in jobs uh, I need more electronics for my little road layer. Uh, let's go back to... This is going to be... Um... <laughs> this, is a, this is a logistics stream now. It's just me being like, okay, shuffle, 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 shuffle. Get it there. Um, so, another space well. Ooh, they're coming way more frequently now, gang. Ugh. Um, I 
I want more electronics in my life. <laughs> oh, I went through a real phase of buying gadgets and now I'm like, I have sufficient gadgets and electronics. It's fine. I just want pot plants. <laughs> um, we need fuel as well. Maybe I can make a fuel refinery. You know what? Actually, you know what I do need, gang? You know what I do need? You know what I do need? I need... A little cleaner a friend in the shape of a cleaner um, I might slap one there so I can cover this area too not to brag but I found that on the first try pro gamer okay this area is super clean we got friendly gremlins now Hell yeah. I'm just going to have a quick bathroom break, folks. But, rest assured, I will be back soon. Be right back. Don't go anywhere. You just move. Don't move. Okay. Okay. Thank you all for waiting. Um, so, in about 15 minutes... Oh, coffee. <laughs> I already have my coffee. It's empty though. Oh, I've got a little bit. It's going to be stone cold though. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. Cold. Maybe I will have a second coffee day. Maybe it is a two coffee day. I don't know. Um, so in about <clears throat> 15 minutes, we're going to have Sam on. Um, and if there's any of you that's keen on giving us feedback live on the internet, um, please stick around because we need your thoughts on stuff. Specifically the planet editor. Right, said Fred. Um, what are we doing? I feel like I go down this rabbit hole. Oh, oh my gosh, look. It's the elevator. Um, I feel like I go down this rabbit hole every stream though. Where I'm like, okay, I have a clear goal in mind. This stream, I want to make astrobolinium. Uh oh. Okay, this is what happens when you antagonize space whales. <laughs> <laughs> when you antagonize the space whales where you're like oh he's a big boy big baby little baby boy and then the actual big big daddy space whale comes along and eats your damn shorts <laughs> oh no please don't go away Sh shunt off oh god oh no y'all this isn't good oh Oh. Oh nom nom. I just got the achievement. Nom nom nom. Mm. Okay. So that's not good. Uh. <laughs> oh my god thanks video game <laughs> oh god are you guys ready for this <laughs> i love how the music's so happy it's like i'm pretty sure a lot of people just died um okay so he lost one bridge one library five houses two schools one well two elevators two potato fields one orchard four houses three tea fields one woodcut of veggie fields three veggie fields two marketplaces ouch a warehouse full of stuff an oil well two ships and we lost 48 peeps um okay <laughs> okay rip bob um Crap. Yeah. <laughs> Emily's the worst world leader in the history of before we leave, probably. Probably. Um. <laughs> You're so right, Wabby. That's so funny. <laughs> okay, so I need to get some freaking stone to this. Oh my god, it ate all of the peeps. The peeps are gone. They're freaking gone, gang. They got- all of them got eaten. That's so messed up. 
What? Oh my god. Wow. Oh my gosh. I've not seen that before. Oh my gosh. Oh well. Emily was just party to a genocide of peeps. <sighs> Feels super bad, man. <laughs> okay, it's time to rebuild the colony. Okay, gang, let's load you up in a ship. We're going to take you to the island um, where 50 people just died. You're going to live in their houses. You're going to take on their jobs. Um, but don't worry about it. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> so the rest of the stream is just me being going to be like, being like, okay, time to read build everything on this island um i wonder if it's worthwhile like moving everything to the other side so i don't have to deal with the astrobolinium because that's gonna pollute the heck out of everything right or 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 this this rove Maybe I'm thinking of my other... Oh, okay. Right. Okay, this is my nice island. I would have been way more upset if this one had gotten slopped. <laughs> this sounds like the synopsis of a dystopian TV show. I know, right? Oh my gosh. Um, have you... Have any of you heard the, the mystery of the Roanoke colony? This is what this feels like right now. Hey. It's very mysterious. Okay. Oh, will I actually even be able to... Okay, sweet. Morbidus. Just slap that down here. <laughs> the peeps are like, oh, everything's... Everything's ruined. Oh my gosh. What happened? What happened? Um, where do I even start? Oh my gosh. So, the port, the port got missed. That's remarkable. So I'm actually just gonna kill that port and use the new one. Um... <clears throat> Let's actually not call that port two. I'll call it port one. Lest I get real confused. Um, I'm going to do this and then I'm going to tell you all about the Roanoke colony as best as I can remember. Ports cannot be destroyed by whales. That's right, we changed that. We did change that, I remember now. Okay, so we're just going to divert everything to this poor little island. Um, what's the main thing that we need? <laughs> wow. Well, um, a ruined library. So sad. Um, okay, it looks like we actually need stone. So let's get. Let's just get the basic set, I think. I think that's a good idea. Oh no, we'll do it this way. So, Fred to Bob. Fred to Bob. <clears throat> Pardon me. Okay, let's do potatoes, stone, tools, wood. Oh, that's right, a ship of mine got eaten too, so I need to fix that up as well. Ok, 
Hooja is not a div, but maybe they are a human wiki. I would say so. I would absolutely say so. Um, so, the Roanoke colony? Oh no. Bob on Toffee Pop is full already? Dang. I am going to get to this. I promise. I just need to concentrate a little bit. Um, okay, sweet. So the Roanoke colony was a a small colony set up by English settlers in America and basically they dropped off a bunch of people by ship and went back to England and then came back and they were just gone. And no one's really ever been able to definitively say where they went um just a bit eerie i'm sure if i were someone living there i'd be like um what happened to my family what the heck all right we're just gonna get rid of these cones um Oh, those ones are actually okay there. We're gonna build a bridge here now. Is the library back? Yay! Everything's fine again. <laughs> uh, let's slap a road. Ooh, a road there. Don't want that there. Cool bananas. We're getting there slowly, gang. Um, just have a... Did it eat the school? That's pretty dark if it did, eh? Let's get rid of that veggie field. I don't think veggies will want to be growing there. Uh, sure, let's repair that house. Oh, the school! Oh, oh that's so dark. Oh, no. What? This is a messed up warehouse. Hang on a minute. I guess it's waiting to be repaired. That's why it looks like that. <laughs> I do not get that reference, Anna. Who is Mr. Shine? No water available. Don't know why. Man, this planet. Ooh. I had a funny feeling it might have been something Terry Pratchett related. I relate more to the three hobbits, uh, three trolls in the Hobbit than Mr. Shine. This girl would probably be a lifelong commitment for me to read at my pace. Yes. <laughs> it's, how many books is Discworld now? Like, so many. So, so, so many. I'm, I think I'm a pretty quick reader and even I balk at Discworld. I'm like, oh, <laughs> there are quite a few. This game is not cute anymore. I want my teddy. What a mood. <laughs> this is rebuilding from the ashes of a broken planet. A broken island, sorry. Oh my gosh. If it was like a little bit more messed up, I actually think I would have just like demolished it and started again. Um, but... It's going to slowly get there, I think. I just need more people. Um, can I perhaps take a bunch of peeps from this place? 
Oh, they're not doing so crash hot with their population either. Yeah, let's take some peeps from here. Uh, let's get that ship and send it to uh, this island and slop some peeps. Emily told us she is going to do the move record for ship launch on the next stream. Yes! And I'll announce the date of that stream never. <laughs> okay, let's just take 30 peeps. I think that's a reasonable amount. Thank you for your noble sacrifice, peeps. We're going to this poor, poor island. The next stream that I'll probably do is uh, making the trailer. Oh, your peeps. <laughs> oh, Bob. On oh, Toffee Pop are happy again. Isn't this island Bob? <laughs> Despite literally everybody perishing, your peeps are not, you know, crumpling under depression and grief. Amazing. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Uh, oh, there's a, there's a quarry here. Sweet, I just had a pause. Okay. Okay. So, we're good for stone now. Let's can that. Let's... I think we're okay for wood. No. Um... We're struggling for water, though. For water. Um, yeah, we'll get some water sent there. Alright. I think I've done what I can here. And the peeps will slowly repop on this island. Uh, okay. Oh, no. They're succumbing to depression again. Because they got eaten <laughs> oh gaming mary's now following thank you for the follow okay okie dokie man i don't even remember what was on this island um iron smelter do i have a rusting hulk i do right next to the well Biscuits. Living on Emily's planets is depressing. <laughs> oh, so sassy. Um, so many games to play. I have yet to play before we leave. Were we talking about... Uh, Bowie, was it you who was saying that you wanted to wait until we do all of our like improvements and add all the content and stuff? A few weeks ago. I feel like we had that conversation, but... You know... <gasps> oh, I'm, I'm just missing the well. Just. Don't worry about it. Um. I guess hello. Hello, Gaming Mary. Hello, hello, hello. So, um. Oh! It's time to ring Sam. Mr. Barham. Get ready. Let's have a cheeky drink. How does Discord work? Hello. Hello, hello. Hello. How are you? Good. Nice. Excellent. Fantastic news. So did you just see all my peeps get eaten? Yeah. <laughs> so bad. Oh no. <laughs> how how was that for you? <laughs> that was that was interesting. <laughs> <laughs> what was going through your head? I'm so curious because I know that the space whales and before we leave are like such a fraught thing, and yeah. we've like talked a lot about them. So like, what what were you thinking? <laughs> um, I was just kind of thinking. Oh, I wonder what she, how she's going to handle that. Oh my gosh. 
fun. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. Sudden horrifying demise of your entire civilization. Yeah, just gone. Like, okay. Yep. Oh well. Um, instead of like a a terrible, you know, eruption like the people at Pompeii had with Mount Vesuvius or like a terrible cyclone or whatever, it's just a space whale instead. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh. These things happen, apparently. Indeed, they do. Mother Nature is a cruel mistress. Yep. Oh my gosh. So, what have you been up to? Ah, um, so we've been uh, working away on the Planet Editor update still. Mm -hmm. um, I can't remember state it was in last week when we talked about it but it's feature complete so we're just down to fixing bugs and responding to people's feedback on it yay um, which is a super great position to be in at this point yes it's wonderful for sure yes um, so and... like when you when you say feature complete that's like when game developers say like we've hit gold and we're just polishing is that do you think that's technically an apt? no so gold gold is based on um back when you produced um cds with your game on it and mm. you'd produce like you'd create an actual literally made out of gold master disc that then all the cds were printed from um so gold means this is actually done this is now going off to be printed for release oh uh, I didn't know that. Like, when you say it was made yeah. out of gold, do you mean, like, it was literally made out of gold? I believe so. That's... It may just have been of gold coloured. I'm not sure. Like, can um, we can we pretend that it was literally gold? Because that's sick. Okay. Sweet. Yeah. <laughs> that um, fits my narrative. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, so, no, we're not we're not at gold yet. Um, we've, so, we've, it's like you've got... You know, you have your, your list of things to, that you want to do for the for the game or for the update. And some of them are like features, you know, new things that you're adding or things that you're tweaking or whatever. Um, and then the rest of it is just bugs and polish and stuff. So we've finished okay. all of the things that we want to add or change or do. Um, and now it's just fixing up bugs and responding to um, testers' feedback and so on. Marvellous. So good. Uh, yeah. So that's um, that's nearly means it's getting close to finished, which is awesome. Um, what a big update! Is this yeah our biggest? Like I feel like in terms of our updates, this is the one that we've worked on for the longest because we started in. Jeez, we started poking around with the planet editor in like February, right? Yeah, I mean we've we've been I mean the. Technically speaking, the planet editor has been in there since long before the game released on Epic, because um, it was something I was wondering about including, um, like a million years ago. Um, <laughs> but it, it never, it never got beyond sort of partially implemented and then turned off in the code, so you couldn't access it. Ah, okay. Gotcha. Um, yeah. That's cool. I think this is this is certainly the most work we've put into a single feature. Um, mm. since release because this this update I mean it's got a few bits and bobs but it's basically just the planet editor um, but that's been a, a large 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 amount of work for um, sure so it's been pretty cool to have that nearly out um, mm. uh, the news ah the Mac build we finally have a release date confirmed for the Mac build which is uh, like less than 24 hours away <laughs> Yes, that was a bit of a shock. Um, yeah. <laughs> so we, we knew it was we knew it was going to be this week. We just weren't sure of the exact timing. Mm -hmm. uh, so I think it's going to be four p.m. UTC on Wednesday. I'm actually going to write that down because I wrote our time, but not the well, yeah. like so more that's, worldwide that's time. So that's four a.m. Thursday New Zealand time. Yay. <laughs> cool beans um that's really really exciting i'm so yeah. glad that uh yeah so i just read what bowie said saying pull your earlobe <laughs> uh, there we go i did it 
Sorry, that threw me for a complete loop. <laughs> um, what were we talking about? The Mac build. That's right. <laughs> yeah, I'm just I'm like, what? That's so funny. Um, yes. Yay, Mac build. So happy to be getting that out. Yeah. Um, that's been a while coming. Uh-huh, for sure. I saw, I saw some... I haven't told you this, actually. I'll tell you now. Uh, but I saw some really nice comments from people on, like, YouTube and stuff being like, yay, thank you for remembering us mac users we usually get forgotten about i was like oh that's sad nice. so um making the making some people happy which is always cool yeah um, uh oh and the other thing so i've got a question for the people in chat yes listen up everybody um, so it's a, it's a little bit fiddly um when you're creating a planet in the planet editor you can add peeps to it so it's possible that you'll have an island that you'll start in your you know you you start your new game and you've got this island uh, planet that you selected that you've created in the planet editor and more than one island has peeps on it to start with so the way we've got it working at the moment is that one island is nominated as your starting island and so that's the only island that's revealed and then when you get to having a ship and exploring the island you can find these other islands with peeps on them and they're not active they just stand there like statues until you colonize the island like land on it with a port um, and we i was just wanting to find out what people in the chat thought like should it be that you have control of both of these islands right from the start or should it be that the island with peeps on it becomes active as soon as you discover it not colonize it um yeah just wondering what people in the chat might think <laughs> i feel like this might be more work for you <laughs> but I guess to me, if I'm making like custom planets, multiple of them, and then um, I'm like going into the main game and like getting ready to play, I guess my expectation would be I'd be able to access the planets, sorry, the islands that have peeps on them straight away. Yeah. But um, let's see what... Uh, what chat thinks. Kuja says, as long as achievements are turned off for the custom islands, I think either way is fine. Maybe a switch for the user to pick. Oh, Yeah, um, it's possible. I think we already have achievements turned off for custom. Yes, yes, yes we do. Sweet. Um, what happens if the second island starts with a port on it? That's a good question. So, at the moment, this is not how it will remain, at the moment, it's still... Um, it's not owned by you, it's not colonised, it just sits there being dumb until you colonise it with your own port and then it becomes your island and you get access to that new port. Um, but that's that's not how I want it to remain, but we'll, I was just, yeah, see what people think. Mm. It just sits um, there being one, dumb. One, <laughs> yeah, one option is that if you discover an island with peeps on it but no port then you don't get control of it until you place a port but if you discover an island with a port then as soon as you find that port the island goes bing now it's your new island hooray or something like that um that's many roads you're upgrading yeah i'm going i'm going nuts <laughs> <laughs> oh, another space well is also coming for me, and I am genuinely feeling a little bit spooked. <laughs> like, no, nah, get It'll out of it. Probably just be a small one. Um, <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> um, Bowie says because of my extensive experience with before we leave, I prefer to abstain from answering. <laughs> um. And a wild Harley says, that sounds like a cool idea. I think people are pretty ambiv ambivalent. I know I am. I'm like, whatever you think is best. Oh. Um, but. Yep. Oh, normally mm. this is a decision that we'd just make up 
for ourselves but given that i was going to be here chalk yeah. talking in the stream and we were only only found out about the problem like an hour ago it was like hmm, i wonder what people think yeah that's really cool thank you for for checking so just to check it. yuri machos and a wild harley the idea that if you find an island with a port it becomes yours but if you find an island without a port you have to put a port on it to gain it does that is that what you're saying sounds like a cool idea Oh. Yes. Yes. Gaming Miri has a question. Probably a dumb question. There is no such thing as a dumb question. Um, does that even work to have a second island without a port from the beginning? Would you be able to use these peeps since there is no building material on it? Well, if the second island had, you know, houses and stuff on it, then you could start using it straight from the beginning, but yeah, it could be a bit um, strange. Mm, yeah, I yeah. guess. Um... And to be to be clear, so the the update that we're planning on doing after this one is allowing people to create their own scenarios. Yeah. And probably when you're able to create your own scenarios, you'll quite possibly be able to pick how you want this to behave. Um, what we're talking about now is like the the default behavior for when you're only able to create an edited planet kind of thing. Mm. Lots of edge cases. <laughs> oh, yes. It'll be very interesting. I'm sure, like, no good plan survives contact with the enemy. So, like, we'll not. obviously have to change things when it goes live because yep. the best way to break a game is by putting it in front of an audience. Um, yep. But we'll figure that out when yeah. we come to it. Yeah, 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 yeah. She'll be right, mate. Emily calling us the enemy. That's exactly what I meant by that <laughs> statement. You, you, you specifically, Kuja. <laughs> yes, the, the enemy. Yep. One, one man, yeah. Kuja. The space in, whale wants to eat everyone. Sorry. In other news, you should go and have a look at the Astrobelinium mine. Oh. And have a look at the peeps that come out of the elevator. Oh, I love I like, them because they're so cute. Yeah. Little. They're just. Let's just you might need really... to you might need to pause real quick to see one. I have the reflexes after like doing our trailer stuff for so long. I'm just like <laughs> on the space bar. So wonder I haven't broken it. Oh, we've got a dog in the road builder. That's cute. The little guy in the road builder and the dog on the new road. That's cute. Um, come on, peeps, where are you? Get in the elevator. Oh, I think there's someone in there now. Uh, there's there's someone in the mine that'll come out when they finish their work day. Come on. Get out of it. Knock off early. It's beer o'clock. Come on. Mm. <laughs> oh. You could be... Oh, oh. Oh. No. Oh. 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 Right up, there suit. we go. Cute. I love this effect, by the way. That looks so cool. Like the big twisting ball. Yeah. So yeah, good. That sinks to Isaac. Oh, oh my gosh. Wait, is that an Among Us imposter? That's a Mogus. So <laughs> technically, we created these models before Among Us got big. But yep. kind of, yeah. Unbelievable. Um, but that's okay, sharing is caring. <laughs> or something, I don't know. Oh, it's funny we're talking about this right now because Fortnite has just put in a, like a, something very, 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 very similar to Among Us into, into the game. So it's like right. <laughs> kind of funny that we're talking about this today. Oh, that's what people on Twitter have been talking about. Yes, yeah, everyone's wondering. losing it. Yeah. <laughs> um, sweet. Well, apart from the Mac OS release coming in less than 24 hours and us going through feedback, um, have you already talked about the changes that you've made to, uh, to the Planet Editor beta branch already? Or... Nah. Or is it like um, nothing super major to mention? 
there's nothing super major to mention. It's just been heaps and heaps of tweaks and bug fixes and polish from feedback and all that sort of thing. Yeah. So if you're Sweet. if you're wanting to help us out making the Planet Editor as awesome as it can be, go and try out the experimental branch. Mm -hmm. um, it's a little bit risky, but give it a go, and hopefully it'll be awesome. And you can tell us what you think. Yes, please. Um, I guess now it's getting to the point in shipping where uh, this is yeah, it's like kind of this period where the more traditional development stops and then like the marketing, the PR and this I guess my stuff comes in where I like make the trailer um, the script is ready to go for the trailer so hopefully I'll be able yeah. to get, what I'm planning on doing is gathering some nice footage for um, for the trailer offline and then on Twitch, I'll just be like importing everything into Premiere and then like putting the trailer together and showing you all what I do. Uh, does that sound like something people would would want? I was I was hoping to like record the the footage for before we leave, like on the stream, but I think because I use screen recording software to stream, it might interact a little bit weird. So I was just going to get the footage and. Yeah, that's that gonna way. hurt. Yeah, I'm like, oh no, my computer will just be like, blah, <laughs> just have a fit. Um, I would watch it if I'm around. I can that way. I can be like, that's wrong, and have no clue what I'm talking about. Oh my god, Kuja, you troll! <laughs> you menace! I'm just gonna like mute you. <laughs> be like, oh. <laughs> That's okay. As a woman in games, you get used to random dudes being like, that's wrong, and they don't know what they're talking about. Ooh, <laughs> oh, spicy or made real. <laughs> I'm dragging you into this, Sam. Come on. <laughs> Come to spicy no worries. with me. <laughs> Just standard stuff at Balancing Monkey Games. <laughs> Just yep. get on my nonsense. I'm like, Come on, gang, let's go. <laughs> yep, totally. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, it looks like we might have broken Kuja. Oh, yeah. It had to happen eventually. Um, cool. Sorry, Kuja. Ah, uh, he'll be fine. Space whales don't cry. <laughs> if Kuja is indeed a space whale, as we all suspect he is. Yeah, um, definitely. Anyway, um, is that is that it for this week? I think so. That's cool. Yeah. Yeah. So, so close to releasing the Planet Editor. Do we have an official date yet, or are we still... Nah. Not yet? Okay, we, maybe. We, we have a, a window that we're likely to release it in, but we don't know that for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully lockdown won't, won't affect anything. It shouldn't, right? Hmm. means I can't release builds for testing, because the computer I do the builds on is in the office, but... Oh. It won't be too bad. Ah, it'll be right. I mean, as so long as the lockdown's short, and if the lockdown's longer, then I'll zoot down and grab my computer and bring it home again or something. Yeah. Oh, gosh. Well, I think you guys will be fine in Dunedin. It's yeah. just Auckland, where I am, that we have to worry about. Yep. Um, so that'll be very interesting. We live in interesting times, everybody. Oh, Oh, boy. yes. Yes, we do. <sighs> Bloody COVID. <laughs> I'll be very happy when it's over and done with. In a few years time probably mm. uh. all right sam well thank you again oh. for for hanging out with me um no worries it's really cool that we're getting closer and closer to shipping the planet editor and yep. um i guess we'll do as per usual we'll do stand up after the stream yep cool okay awesome. well thanks again see ya bye Thank you, Sam person. <laughs> That's so nice. If I am a space world, do I get likeness royalties? <laughs> oh my god, good. <laughs> if you can prove that you look like a cosmic leviathan, then yes. <laughs> um, now, what was I doing? So my plant's looking really nice. I've got the roads. I should get some power poles, actually. Um... 
just whoop 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 um wow I've got a lot of stuff here do I go does that like string across I wonder like from there to there that'd be cool Let's give it a crack. Let's see what happens. Just want to see how that interacts before I do anything. Um, how did the road builder get up the elevator? It can't be known. Can't be known. Um, hey, let's see how my Eaton Planet's going, yeah? Eaton Planet. Eaton Island, I should say. Okay. So the peeps are moving very slowly. Oh, that's bad. Oh, highly polluted. Yeah, 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 yeah. This poor planet, y'all. Is Infmon Sam? Sure is. Sure is. Um. I. I missed the memo. No, the the roads are like my one of my favorite parts of Before We Leave. When we made, when we uh did the update for the roads, uh, a year ago I think. Wow, I loved recording the trailer for that so much. It was so much fun. Like the road build is one of my favorite things, just because it's so cute. And square the roads themselves are really beautiful I just I had such a great time making that trailer <laughs> yeah there's uh, uh, Sam is a, is a man with many many titles <laughs> um So we don't have any power here anymore. Hmm. We've only got a single wood generator. Maybe it's time to... <sighs> I wonder if I can build a solar power thing here. Oh, I need a lot of stuff. Struth. Hmm. Blast. Ho. Hum. Do I even have like a woodcutter here? Now? Let's find out. On Bob. Ruined oil well. Oh. Blast. That's like r kind of right in the middle of town. Let's actually ditch that. No wonder I'm struggling for power now. That makes sense. Um, maybe I can slap it here. It's pretty polluted through here anyways, so. Oops, there's no road there. Doi. Um, okay, let's do that. Let's do that. Oh, hello, Princess Richard. How's it going? Thanks for the follow, by the way. Oh my god, Wabby. <laughs> That's a dad joke. Speaking of woodcutters, I recently tried to join a woodcutting forum, but I could not log in. Oh my god. <laughs> I rate that dad out of 10. I 
I have one big feedback as a total noob. Bob isn't a totally inadequate name for a planet. Well, you can direct your complaint to... Was that another Sam name for the planet? I feel like that's an another Sam name. <laughs> Goldfish show really enabling the bad puns right now. Unbelievable. You would. You would. <laughs> I feel like, yeah, usually I can like look at the planet names in this and be like, I'm pretty sure Sam named that. Oh my god! Hey Richard, what's up? <laughs> That's so rad, thank you so much for coming and hanging out with me. <laughs> yeah, that was funny. After I left yesterday. Um, I'm like, okay, I guess we'll be going into lockdown. Thank goodness my eyebrows look fine now. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh my god. Um, what was I doing? <laughs> Have you started playing Old Friends yet? Oh, actually chat. Y'all need to check out Old Friends by our mates over at Runaway Play. Um, they're lovely people, they're in Dunedin, and they're just, hang on a minute, old friends mobile game. Let's see if I can bring it up. Look at this game. Look, it's so cute. I'm just gonna kill the music so it doesn't clash, but. So this is a mobile game. It's another Kiwi game, and y'all should play it. It's so cute. You'd like go and adopt dogs and make friends and like there's the cute little storyline or two. And it's free! Uh, and the people that made it are absolutely lovely. So please go check it out. Um At least the names of the islands are more funny than mine. I'm so uncreative when it comes to naming things. <laughs> You don't have to be creative. Being practical is also just as valid. They look fine now, but after three years of lockdown, yeah. Oh. <laughs> I don't know if you all know the Australian Prime Minister from back in the day, John Howard, who has like eyebrows like that. They're very woolly. Google him if you want to check out some eyebrows that need taming. Yes, I downloaded it on the bus home. It's so wholesome. Yes! Hell yes. So good. It is Doggos. The game is just pure Doggos. It's based on um, real... It's sort of based on real life. There's like an old dog sanctuary in... I want to say Tennessee? In the States? That look after Doggos. Who are... Who are senior. It's very, very wholesome and beautiful. So we've got the fuel refinery happening. We just need... Uh, we just need oil now. Oh, I'm missing so much stuff now. Damn space whales. Um... Wait, did I see the trailer for this on E3 or maybe the awards show? Um, you might have. A wild Harley? Yeah. Australia doesn't have prime ministers. They have a British queen. <laughs> My planets are called Prima Seconds. I like that. Um, I, uh... I get confused if I call my planets like planet one and planet two. It just like starts to look a little bit samey after a while to me. Respect that you can like keep up with that. Um, what was the name of the mobile game? The game's called Old Friends. Thank you. Thank you, Richard. I actually forgot. I can, it's, it's a, like a, a weird name in my head. I can never remember it properly. I'm like, what's it called again? <laughs> um, yeah, gosh, the people at Runaway are lovely. They're really, really good people. Um, 
Anyway, I still need power here, funnily enough. And I don't actually think that I have a woodcutter still. Pretty sure got eaten. Um, where do I want to put it? Um, maybe I'll just slap it here. Look, there's one there. A tree there. Wait, I do have a woodcutter. Why don't you work harder, please? Please. Unbelievable. Um, maybe I will build a an oil generator here. I hate the oil generators. Ugh. I always feel bad putting them down. I'm like, Dang. Thanks downloading it right now, even though I'm a cat person. That's fair, that's fair. What was the, the really popular uh, kitty game? Kitty mobile game? Nik Nik Nikatsume, I wanna... I wanna say? It's very sweet. Um, very much kicked off a kind of zeitgeist of these sorts of games. Nintendogs? Oh my god. <laughs> Leave. <laughs> oh, Nintendogs. I never played that. Nikotsume. Sweet. Yes. So good. So good. Such an influential game. Um, Alright, I'm just gonna bite the bullet and make an oil generator and I don't feel good about it and I don't want to, but you know, this poor island needs power. More power! Um, iron mine, huh? What if I shifted the... Uh, I'm in a bit of a pickle now, actually. Okay, let me put the iron mine elsewhere. Buildings must face the road. Dang it. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. Okay, no, that's not going to go there then. Oh, where can I put the... Where can I do it? What's a sage for Nintendo, Kuja? Is that like a evangelist for Nintendo where you like go around and like spread the good word of Nintendo? I'm going to the planet get vaxxed, friendly reminder to everybody. If you can get vaxxed, that is. I know not everyone can. Okay, let's power that elevator. Power that elevator! Nintendogs was my first DS game and yeah, I thrashed it, except I was only allowed to play it outside because my whanau was sick of me constantly yelling at my dog. <laughs> that's so funny, you're just like yelling at a virtual dog so they send you outside. Like, that's just, that's so funny to me. Wow. What a, what a parallel, I feel like. Where, like, people send their dog outside because they're yelling at it indoors because it's, like, shit on the carpet or whatever. <laughs> but now, thanks to technology, you can get sent outside for yelling at your dog on your DS. Oh my god, that's marvellous. Putting in power lines everywhere, folks. Did this, does that string across? I've never seen this before. Oh! Sam, Isaac, you guys really did think of everything. That's so cool. Look at it, it's a little bridge with a power line on it. Oh! Mar marvelous. Absolutely marvelous. Basically, so a. Nintendo Sage was basically someone who lived on their forums a hundred years ago. Interesting. Well, Nintendo is a very old company. And then the Knights of Hyrule were their volunteer mods. Oh, that's pretty cool. More electronics. 
Like, you got it. <laughs> Electronics building is super cute. I like it a lot. Um, you know what I need? I need a research institute. That's what I need. I'll build that in a in a hot minute. Ooh. Okay, let's get let's get this uh, all powered up. I'm probably gonna use these planets for the. Oh wait, that's right. No, I'll be, have to make custom planets for the next update. That's right. Ah. <sighs> Oh, this doesn't have any power to it. Okay, well, that's a problem. Marvelous. Marvelous, marvelous, marvelous. This planet's looking good, y'all. Planet Island. Oh my gosh, I'll get that right one day. Um. Oh, we need a lot of stuff for the ages. I'm going to bed. Have a nice day, everyone, says Gaming Miri. Gaming Miri, thank you so much for hanging out. I know it's late where you are. I appreciate you coming and chilling. Sleep well. Um, what am I doing now? <laughs> what am I doing now? An Emily Ladder story. Oh, not another space whale. <laughs> I'm gonna complain to the manager if it's uh. If it's a really big one again, that poor little planet of mine over on Toffee Pop. Maybe I shouldn't have called the planet Toffee Pop. Maybe that's the actual issue here, hey? Don't need that elevator now. Um, who made that game? Not me. <laughs> have words with it we may need to <laughs> implement a performance improvement plan oh my gosh spoken like a true managing director <laughs> that's so good that's a protective em uh, elevator i nearly called it an, a protective emily <laughs> god that's where i'm at today already got brain worms and we're less than 24 hours into lockdown love this for me Uh, okay, let's just get a road boop, all the way through here. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Poor Pete wheeling the wheelbarrow like across rugged terrain, just like, oh god, <laughs> takes so long. Oh, my peeps are becoming unhappy. Oh dear. Who could have anticipated that? Not me. Or I give my peeps the bare minimum. I'm just like, clothes and vegetables, you're fine. You don't need anything else. Don't even give them clothes, Kooji monster. <laughs> what if they get cold or sunburned? What happens then? No tacos for them, only raw veggies. Oh, tacos. Maybe I should make tacos for dinner tonight. Yes, folks, it is that time again. It's 20 to 12 here in Aotearoa. And that's nearly lunchtime, and you know what that means. It's time for me to talk about food <laughs> and nothing else. Are tacos a thing in this game? No. But we have a smoothie maker and a kitchen. So maybe you could imagine tacos being made in the kitchen. <laughs> Theatre of the mind. Okay. <gasps> food stream? Oh, man. That could be cool. I don't know if I'd do it though. <laughs> I cook very like... Hmm. I don't follow instructions when I cook. I just put whatever in. And I'm like, this should taste good. The flavour profiles... Match. 
did a lot of experimenting when I first moved out of home. Oh my god, no, not Toffee Pop again! The Space Whale. <sighs> Let's see. Is it here yet? Not quite, not quite. Okay. We're safe for now, fam. You know what would be so funny? If it ate my planet Bob. Again. I'd be like, hmm, okay, well, I guess I'll just abandon this island. <laughs> oh. I think I need to fix this island off air. Because, wow, it is toast. <laughs> Emily's going to be a number one Twitch streamer by doing cooking streams. Oh my god. I don't know if Twitch can handle the amount of swearing that I do in the kitchen. Like, I can only contain my Aussie nature so much. It comes out when I drive and when I cook. Actually, I don't think I swear that much in the kitchen anymore. Maybe I'm wrong. Um. Okay. Oh! Hey, Sophia. Oh, the space wheel's coming. Okay, he's a, he's a little boy. Oh god. <laughs> Aussie, Aussie, Aussie. Oi, oi, oi. Yep. Cool. Oh. <sighs> so broken. A small boy. A little baby boy. There are some streamers swearing all the time. Yeah, that's true, actually. Little boy eats 128 peeps. Oh no. <laughs> well, that one's a good boy, because he ate from the the space elevator instead of the people. <laughs> um okay, let's just ignore that. Ignore that completely toast planet and get back here. Protect all the Okay, so now I have to build an Aegis shield. Have I researched that yet? I think I have. have. So it's just the whale charmer that I'm thinking of. That boy deserves head pats. Imagine how big you'd have to be to like adequately head pat a space whale. I think you'd have to be pretty big. Okay, what sea creature could head pat a space whale? Like, on a cosmic level, obviously. So space Blah, you know. A space kraken? Yep, yep, that tracks. <laughs> What's a Canada arm? Can it sounds like Canada. No whale feeders. Just a gigantic whale pet padding. Canada. Help. Help. What is that? Help. Oh, that's so... Oh, of course you'd know that, oh my goodness. It's it's the robotic arm that they put on the ISS. Right. Right. I'm oh, sorry. Interesting. Um, okay. I'm just faffing around now. Let's see what I can do on ye old Toffee Pop. Poor Toffee Pop. Can we put a research institute down? That's the million dollar question. Where does that live again? Which menu is that in? Help! Where's the research institute? Help! <laughs> Forgotten where it is. Have I not researched it yet? That'd be f ironic. Battery power filtering, shelters, airships, museum, training ground, salt removal. Bloody put that on Twitter. Hey yo. 
You can't get it until you've got the crystal island. Ugh. Dang it. I forgot. <laughs> Why are you not working? Alright, that's okay. Canada, Canada, Canada. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> oh. Um. Okay, let's just see about... Oh. Actually, no, maybe I'll ship the Astrobolinium. Uwu Astrobolinium to Toffee Pop and then shield up from here. Um. Oh, that's rough. Or maybe I will do it on that island. I'm just like ping ponging between them thinking about it. Sorry, why? Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, yeah, I think that's going to be cool. I think that'd be cool. Um, space elevator. And, oh, maybe I can do it on another island. Hmm. There's a meme and stereotype of how Canadians apologize all the time. And Tim Hortons, is that the other, the other way in which Canadians get poked fun at? Oh my god. Okay, yeah, I'm just going to do it on that island. Am I making glass here? Three million dollar question. Hut, 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 hut. Catch it here. Glass melter. See, yeah. Okay, sweet, 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 sweet. Let's do it. Let's hit the go button, folks. Ah, oh. the Aussie chant. I hate that so much. It's so like this irrational hatred in me of that chant. It represents a very like a part of the Aussie population that is uh, a little problematic. <laughs> They're the sort of people that usually have bumper stickers that are like, if you don't love it, then leave it. Bogan? Yes. Indeed. Dang, really? Yeah, yeah. That's my experience anyway. Your mileage may vary. Hopefully the younger folks like millennials or even Gen Z will like maybe reclaim it. I don't know. And make it not something exclusive to people who drink VB and are racist. Quebecers are not like that. Ah! So, is there much of a difference between the culture in Quebec versus uh, the Canada that people outside of Canada talk about? Bowie? I'm curious. Also, can we build this in the last 10 minutes of the stream? That'd be pretty cool. This planet is... Planet? There I go again. This island is struggling for peeps. I probably need to upgrade some houses. <laughs> okay, oh my god. No! I promised you all there wouldn't be a noisy motorbike on this stream because we're in lockdown and there was one! One! Ugh. Another of my brethren will eat your peeps. Wow, Kuja, wow. Uh, I made the mistake of buy buying VB for a work do once, knowing nothing about beer. It was not popular. <laughs> That's very funny to me. I had a neighbour in my hometown of Canberra, Canberra, um, that 
drank VB, like he'd come home just about every day with a massive slab of beer. And I was like, hey, Peter, you're drinking vomit bombs again. I'm like 15. He, he was not happy with me. Oops. Um. <laughs> and yes, Bowie, that's exactly what I mean. Noisy motor bike must be picking, must be heading to the pharmacy to pick up meds or perhaps starting her essential shift at 12. I hope so. I hope so. You get a bit sick of noisy motor motorbikes living on a main road after a while. Oh no, the happiness of my peeps on Cuddle Island on Get Vaccinated is starting to drop. Well, why? I've given you absolutely nothing. Why aren't you happy? Go drink some kombucha or something. What can I give them to make them a little bit happier? Mm. Meaning square? Fountain? Oh, that's right. The fountain needs a green square and I don't have one of those right now. Let's slap that right here. Vaccines causes happiness to drop confirmed. Oh my god. Big, big sarcasm there for anyone watching outside of Twitch that didn't see Sophia's sarcastic slash S classic internet phrase. I will admit, when I got my Pfizer, the the night of, I didn't sleep super well, so I wasn't very happy, but I was just bloody jazzed to have that sweet, sweet science juice, TBH. Quebecers are mostly French-speaking, says Bowie, and the rest of Canada is mostly English-speaking, so there are big differences and people like to focus on them, but we share a lot of things, like our love for bad coffee from Tim Hortons or McDonald's. Keyword being mostly. Uh, okay. I mean, like, I feel like people are pretty similar worldwide. We have similar needs. We all deserve to be loved and treated well. Uh, science juice. Yes, I can't remember where I picked that up from. That's. I think that might have been a My Brother, My Brother and Me episode. Love the McElroy brothers. They're hilarious. Ooh. My rusting hulk's depleted. Ew. Where though? Where, 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 where? Where though? Where did it go? Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from, Cotton Eye Jerry? <laughs> Funniest streamer, NAOCE, and EU. Um, La Motte de Fedre. I'm sorry if I said that badly. Uh, says, I miss my Tim Hortons, but now I'm in New Zealand. Oh, kia ora. Welcome. How am I? Um, but agreed, there's some big cultural differences between Quebec and the rest of Canada. Yeah. Oh, were you, Sophia? You were about to sing good old Cotton Eye Joe. That's funny. Oh, hey. Hey, Sam. What's up? Everyone say hi to La Motte de Fedre. You'll have to take me through how to say that later Sam please and thank you <laughs> so Sam C I mentioned last week on stream is our lovely producer she's joining us temporarily to help us uh, improve our processes in the studio um, and she's great 10 out of 10 human being I hope your lockdown's going well so far Sam A wild Harley says that's that's the opposite of my experience. I was so tired after the vaccine and wound up sleeping most of the next couple of days. Look, I think Yeah, it 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 affects us all differently. For sure. Um, like one of my flatties 
had a had a fever, like a really bad fever, and then it disappeared very suddenly, and he was absolutely fine. Bowie says on the topic of Canada and Quebec. Uh, people in provinces will gladly put election signs on their lawn, but this is extremely rare in, rare in Quebec. Huh. That's very- I think that's very rare here. Not seeing that often. Is Kia ora Māori? Yes. Yes it is. Sure is. Yeah, Sophia, I hope you're going well too with lockdown. Thank God we got NZGDC in before we went into lockdown, huh? What a treat. Oh, this this Aegis is coming up. I'm coming up. Oh, Anna, you're living the dream. I want chickens. I've always wanted chickens. Maybe when I'm older. Love me some pies here in New Zealand. You don't get those in Canada and Quebec. Not the mini ones anyway. Yes, yeah, so we call, for those of you who don't know from other parts of the world, our pies here in New Zealand and Australia are like meat pies. So when you say, I'm going to go get a pie from the bakery, that means you're going to go get a meat pie. And it's like, you know, steak, mince with gravy, whatever. Um, whereas like in America and Canada, right? I could be wrong. You, pies refer to like sweet pies. What do you call an apple pie? An apple pie. So if you're really jonesing for an apple pie, you're like, oh, I feel like an apple pie right now. It's not just pie. Oh, that's right. The Aegis needs power. Um, all right. And now it's time to, to flank this sucker in. Um, wind generators? I've always really struggled to power the uh, the Aegis, actually. Um, so let's just build a bunch around it. Sweet. <laughs> so fair. Is you can get a couple of chickens and count down or New World. Oh my god. <laughs> and we sure did, Wabby. <laughs> You're here right on time for that chicken life. Um, thank you for the lesson, says a wild Harley. You're welcome. I'm sure there's like other stuff we could talk about as well. There's just like a few small differences, eh? Um, Quebec has large meat pies, but like otherwise a pie is sweet in North America. Oh, oh I want, I can't, I can't go to the bakery and get a pie for lunch because we're in lockdown and I just wanted to say that I'm very sad because I was about to be like, oh, I'll go get a pie for lunch. I can't, <laughs> I can't. <laughs> That's okay. I'll just maybe this lockdown I'll learn how to make pies. If my partner is still in chat, Mark, 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 we need to make pies, please. Let's figure it out. Let's figure it out. Figure it out. Oh, lunchtime. Oh no, sorry, Emily. It is a okay. It is okay. Was that peak? That was peak ASMR. I'm so glad. Did I grab takeout just before midnight? I did. My flatties and I were like, it's time. Let's get takeout before Aunt Cindy locks us up. <laughs> oh, yeah. I think pot pies are the same as pies, pies, right? Oh, my God. <laughs> I need to go eat. It's lunchtime. That's so funny. You can also buy frozen pies in lockdown. But there's something about a fresh pie, Yuri Man shows, from the bakery or just like homemade fresh out of the oven. Dear God, you'll burn your tongue, but it tastes good. Wow, this 
Wind generator is really struggling. Pie stream? Oh, yeah, the stream's just two hours of me shoveling pies into my mouth. You know, this is <laughs> maybe not a funny story, but it's a story. I went and told my doctor, who was concerned about my iron levels. I was like, oh, I should be okay. I eat meat. I have like a meat pie once in a while. And every appointment since then that I've had with her, she keeps being like, you're still eating meat pies. They're really bad for you kind of thing. And I'm like, I eat them once a bloody month. Get it off my back. It's so bad. <laughs> like, ma'am, I'm a 30-year-old woman. Let me eat my damn pies if I want to. Hey, Emily, I had French toast. Food is good. Oh. oh, once a month. Oh my god, you die soon. That's okay. At least I'll die with a belly full of pie. Oh, a pot pie has a lid of pastry on top. Maybe no base. That's horrifying to me. Pies aren't that bad. No, like if you eat them every day, they'll like, you know, affect you, but not enough to like, you know. Oh god, I just noticed a space whale came by. I didn't even notice. I was too busy obsessing over pies. Um, we're having some power issues, folks. Um, and that's why I'm not getting gadgets right now. What's going on? What's up with my oil generator? Why aren't you doing the thing, please? Let's throw a party. Did I actually end up making... Okay, let's throw a party for the peeps, y'all. Oh, look at that lovely location. It's got a lake with a pentagon. Oh, that's so nice. My monkey says our daughter just came in and asked us if we wanted, if we wanted her to bring us anything for lunch. Oh, that's so sweet. That's adorable. Um, Sam C says I looked up the definition of pot pie. A pot pie is a noun. Good to know. North American, a savory pie baked in a deep dish, typically with the top crust only. Ah, uh, okay. I see. I see. Alright, let's throw a party for the peeps and end the stream. Look at them all go. It's a lockdown rave where we just wiggle. This is how I dance. How the peeps dance is how I dance. 100%. You've got carte blanche to requisition her to cook your fave things. Nice. <laughs> the people just like not going to the party are the introverts of the island. <laughs> the person with the wheelbarrow. Go to the party with your wheelbarrow, you coward. Yeah, they are cute emotes, Wabby, for sure. Adorable. Essential workers can't leave their posts. Oh, you're so right. While the rest of us are vibing at home, the essential workers are out there doing their thing. Thank you for your sacrifice, essential workers. Lovely. Well, the party's done. Everyone's back to work. And hopefully that will make them happier so I can get more power. Love it. Well... That was an interesting stream, everybody. I hope you all had fun. Um, so just a friendly reminder, our Mac OS build of Before We Leave will be available in less than 24 hours on Steam. Can I just confirm that it will also be on the Epic Games Store? Sam? If you're still around? <sighs> Oh my god. Are you celebrating the Mac release with Maccas? I would love some dirty Ronnies right now. Oh my gosh. 
Okay, cool. So the Mac OS release is also on the Epic Games Store. Fantastic. We don't want to neglect our EGS friends. Thank you. Um, fantastic. I think that's all. I'll be back next week. Hopefully, tentatively, unless something changes, with a different stream. Um, I'll make our... Or maybe I'll do a separate stream for it. I'm not quite sure yet, but just stay tuned. Join our Discord, check our Twitter for updates. But I'm really looking forward to doing a stream where I make a trailer in front of y'all. And pie stream. Oh my god. That would be in the very, very distant future. I have to learn how to make pies first. Speaking of, it's time to go eat some lunch. Thank you all so much for joining me. You're all beautiful, amazing. Mwah. Lots of love. I'll see you all next Wednesday. Take care, everyone. Kia ora.